大家好，欢迎来到梦境聊球。现在为大家带来的比赛是2018年热身赛，杜峰指导带领的中国男篮篮队对阵加拿大男篮的比赛。从双方实力来讲，由于对方阵中有 R.J. 巴雷特、迪龙布鲁克斯、德怀特鲍威尔等多名 NBA 球星，中国男篮实力明显弱于对手。全场比赛的过程也似乎印证了这一点。加拿大从开局就一路领先，多点开花，压着中国男篮打。反观中国男篮，只能靠着吴前的三分球勉力支撑。吴前本场比赛投中了七记三分，是中国男篮为数不多的亮点。本以为这场实力悬殊的比赛也就这样过去了，没想到第四节赛场上突生波澜，在中国队的一次进攻中。NBA 著名水货状元用力推倒了中国男篮球员陆文博，还鼓动现场观众情绪，极为嚣张。然而，中国男篮的年轻人们此刻都懵了，竟然没人敢为队友出头，只有愤怒的杜指导冲上前去怒骂本内特。随后，杜指导也怒斥场上球员不够团结。之后，杜指导和本内特都被罚出了场。最终，中国男篮也以6 2二比九十输掉了比赛。Giving up on this team. Him from the game. It was a it was a bad foul. It was a dumb foul. He was called for an unsportsman. Ejected Bennett, and they didn't. The first signal. I'm going to tell you right now. The first signal the officials gave was an unsportsmanlike foul. They did not signal an ejection. After all the excitement happened, is when they changed their mind. Yeah, I'm really disappointed. So what's going to happen now here is. The technicals were two shots, yeah, right? We might yeah. see a little bit of,、uh, you know,、uh, sloppy play early on as they try to get themselves accustomed to, to being out there and playing. And Powell、uh, wins the opening tip for Canada, and it's going to be Phil Scrub. Rich possession of the sea, and his family sitting just behind us here, as the opening、and、bucket goes from that screen, and they had a mismatch inside, but Phil Scrub just did a great job of denying that、uh, post entry. Olenek open for three, and he makes it. Gives a little salute. Going inside off the glass is Hugh, and he is China. Ren, being checked by Olinik, goes inside, and McCann gets the layup against Powell. North America officials tend to allow a lot more contact. Three ball on the way in the face of Powell is、uh, scrub long range two. Impressive shot for him off the glass. Now in transition, it's going to be Brooks off the glass, and he makes that bucket. And Canada up. Blocked by Scrub. And Scrub leading the transition. It's going to be Barrett in for the dunk.、Uh, R.J. Rand is laying hard off that. Another top of the circle attempt from China. No good, and the rebound back down to Wu. Oh, he traveled. He traveled. He took a big extra step there, but he got away with it. Huge. Back to Nemhart. He'll fire away from the left wing. Way strong. Scrub trying to get the ball gets the rebound. Boucher will fire away again. This time, no mistake. Great hustle to track that. And now Nemhart finding Edgem into the corner. Heslop. He's a sharpshooter, and he shows it there. Yeah, Canada really took advantage. China. Ren with the ball. Trying to find room in the paint, goes off the glass. Strong rebound down to Tao, back out to Gao Shang, and he can't get the shot to go. But the easy rebound and Canada quickly taking advantage, getting the opportunity before he went off to play for Houston. That must have been some atmosphere. As、uh, China looking to respond out of the timeout, and they do with a three、Canada. from the top of the half, going to his left. Going to the baseline and edge him with the reverse side on the switch, getting the pass back from Gao and he makes the two from behind the foul line. Oh, at the top of the circle over to McCann, looking to drive left and now in the corner three ball is good by Wu. Yeah, they 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 get Phil Scrub back out. It's going to be Barrett inside pass for Powell with a big two-handed flush. Phil Scrub gets his. Screen goes to the center of the court. Now jumper on the way. Now let's see. It. Now working on the right side. Cross. It's going to be Bennett with the three. Well, China trying to 
get the ball around the court here. Three ball from the corner. The second chance opportunity does fall for Shane by Nemhart into the paint. Nice strong move to the hoop by Hanlon Tao and Heslip. Getting around a couple of screens. Let's go of a long two and nails it. Three for three. He doesn't need Wu. a lot of back across. Wu getting the pass back from Lou. Nine to shoot. At the top of the circle, ball entered into Tao. Gets the ball, gets caught. Second period. And that foul Not shot dropped Nemhard with the rebound out to Edgem. And going inside in transition, it's going to be Canada Scrub, Connor the Scrub. And China as Brooks going to the hoop and lays it in off the glass smoothly. Yeah, Canada pick. Ball inbounded quickly, and it's going to be a three point shot from the corner that is converted by Brooks. Nice little end line. But they do get the turnover. Ball worked away in transition. Olenek with the block, but the second chance opportunity for China. I that. think he did turn around and kind of give a little gesture to the referee as, as in asking why there wasn't. And China replies from a top of the circle shot from Wu. Looking. And finding Brooks this time from the other yeah. side of the... In this game. And Brooks now from the three-point line and he is absolutely on fire. Yeah, that's three straight. And uh, Team Eat China... Back in action here, China with the ball. Ball entered into Tao and he lays it in. One thing I'll give the China credit for, every time they've come out Close of the timeout. One hand pass to Edgem into the corner, Brooks again, he's open. <laughs> and, and is so he having this a... one, 76 to 40 as we uh, edge towards the end of the third quarter and there another nice lay in by Tao who he is, again. Uh, <laughs> It's just not even a challenge for him anymore. And now Boucher has the ball, goes up strong. Great time against to Barrett was up on his feet. Ren for Wu. Let's go over three ball on that one. Beautiful About shot. So they're going to run down the clock for the final possession here. Three seconds to go. A long range three that was off balance, and it falls for Wu. All well, Team China with the ball looking to add to the momentum from that buzzer beating three at the end of the third quarter. Once again, it's Hugh. Now it's Gao. Jumper off the glass and it's Boucher. Gets one from Hugh. Jintri Hu. And there is Hugh again wearing number 21, working against three Canadian defenders. Gets the loose ball back and makes good on that broken play. Uh, Boucher had uh, not surprising uh, Wu for now we're going to have another unsportsmanlike foul. As uh, not only did, oh, the, the Chinese coach on the floor, that was, uh, we'll see the replay here, but it's an uns And now we're going to give a technical foul to the Chinese coach. And meanwhile, the Canadian player. Because he's out on the floor going after Bennett. And it uh, looks like you know, oh. Triano's going to come out and get it taken care of. Oh, Absolutely incensed with that foul committed by Bennett. Chinese coach actually wants to and go. And the foul count was 21 to 12. And that was before the little uh, ruhaha earlier in this quarter. Is Nichols shooting the and ball China. well, and uh, it's a tough. It's tough for them because. Second shot is a little bit down. differently in preparation for a World Cup that they know they're going to be in. Absolutely, yeah, absolutely. And there's a huge dunk there huge. from one of. The Over to Ren now, three pointer on the way from and then Beautiful. now China with the ball. It's going to be Wu three ball, very good shooter. Corner. Ren up top, Yu. Yu finding room right side to the hoop. And he gets that bucket to go. Oh, for, and there's uh, a little, you know, at least a bit of an interesting plot line for Sunday, perhaps. Hey. Perhaps we can, uh, you know, coach versus uh, <laughs> So we'll see what China has drawn up on this final possession. And it's going to be Wu once again. And his last shot will not go. And that will end it for both these teams with Canada ahead 